What's up folks? Coming at you with the quarantine quickie for today, April 8th, 2020. Today's quarantine quickie question comes from, once again, Mr. Jim Massa, the resident scientist of the Deep Purple podcast. And in an effort to get some love for the, the keys, Jim says, what are your top five John Lord album solos with Deep Purple? So I was immediately thinking of some live solos, but he did specify album. So um, I'm going to start. Uh, I've got a, a couple dark horse candidates and then some kind of obvious ones, probably. Um, in fifth place, I've got Slow Down Sister off of Slaves and Masters. Slow Down Sister. Not um, probably tops on most people's mind. Uh, Slaves and Masters is usually not something that uh, it comes up in my top lists but um i think it's a i think his organ in, in general just kind of makes that song and, the, and his his little rhythmic thing he does during the during the chorus is kind of one of the more interesting things of the song when he goes into the solo it's it's probably one of the few john lord solos that i could play if i spent a lot of time practicing probably but it's not it's not technically super challenging but it's just a very interesting solo he's got a great tone i'm, I'm I'm sure Jim would know, but I don't know exactly what piece of gear he's using for that solo, but it's got great sound to it. In fourth place, I Am Not Your Lover off of Perpendicular. Uh, this is kind of the opposite. There's no, if I practiced from now until for the next 20 years, I could probably never play this. And it's it's a return to very classic John Lord solos, mixing like complicated, like lead guitar sound almost with like a Bach fugue which nobody does better than John Lord and it's kind of got that yeah, sped up Bach kind of feeling to it amazing solo and it kind of kicks into like a little bit more traditional solo after that and then goes uh, le leads the way for Steve Morse to um, deliver an incredible solo right after that third place Burn um, very uh, you know one of his more uh, composed solos, but love that song, love his solo work in that. And it's got some similarities with uh, I'm Not Your Lover and just the kind of tone and the style of what he's playing. Third place, probably the most obvious one of all, Highway Star. Much like uh, Richie's solo, uh, Lord's is extremely well composed and uh, features some really just really cool John Lord style things. He's got some great arpeggios going through it, and then he also does that kind of that chromatic run, and then he doubles it with the, the lower octave, um, which he says he, he overdubbed, but I've seen him do it live, so <laughs> he's, he does it live and says, oh, that's terrible, that's why I had to overdub it, but it sounds great to me. Uh, but a great solo. That part I can I can almost play. Probably, probably the one part, though, not the two. Uh, then in first place, Jim says he could guess what my first place uh, for John Lord solos is, and let's see if he's right, but I have a feeling he might be. It's Rap Bat Blue off of Who Do We Think We Are. Uh, again, an absolute standout track on that album. Uh, if you're in my camp and love that album, or if you're in the camp of most people and think that album is subpar, it is an incredible solo, where, uh, incredible technical feat, and he ends it with like like a very again goes into that traditional John Lord wailing sound on his organ and and it's quite a testament to him that you know, Richie Blackmore took a few stabs at guitar solos and was just whether it was that he was over it and just not into it or he's just like I can't really make it work on this song uh, John Lord stepped in and took 100% of the solo responsibilities on that song and he delivers for sure so those are my top five let me know what your top five are let me know why I'm an, a stupid idiot and why I got it all wrong and why Highway Star should be number one and I should never have mentioned anything from Slaves and Masters. Whatever you got, let me know uh, what you think and we'll hopefully be with you again tomorrow.